Oh, we have done an assessment of the Yolanda donations, okay? And we're going to make that report, I think, uh, on or around November 8. This was something requested of us by the people themselves when we first came into office last July. So many farmers, uh, uh, fisher folks, talked to us and ask us about their emergency shelter assistance three years after Yolanda. So we decided to have an uh, internal assessment of the donations given to the DSWD as well as other funding. So we have done it. We're going to make a report. I think generally uh, the money has gone to the people, but there are cases of irregularities. No? Uh, uh, we have submitted the report to the president already of a particular irregularity, and we have asked the, him to initiate the investigation. So we will come out uh, with that uh, during by next month before the Yolanda, the third year of Yolanda. M our team is reporting a more detailed report. Um, main problem natin with Yolanda is while we have provided more than 1 million emergency shelter assistance to the victims, there are around 200,000 claimants who expressed um, the complaint that they were victims of Yolanda in Region 8 and Region 6, but they were not given the assistance needed. That's why here in uh, Lawin, we said emergency shelter assistance should be emergency, not three years, not two years after. But would you describe, ma'am, the irregularity as widespread? Or is this concentrated in some areas? Only? Well, the ESA is widespread. You know, the disqualification, the exclusion okay. of emergency shelter assistance for victims of Yolanda is widespread. We're talking 200,000. Uh, initially, we had 81,000 for Panay. And then we still have boxes of claims that uh, some members came to give to us. And then you have Region 8, Leyte and Samar. I think that will be also around 100,000. And this is because there were prohibitions regarding uh, uh, providing assistance to those who were in the danger zones, but who were also damaged. But, you know, they were, and there was no relocation for them. Two, uh, it was also because, um, I, I think, uh, I, I, because some local, go it went through the local government units. And again, you had hindi patas na pagtrato. So there were people who were victims of Yolanda, but who were not part of the, of the political groupings of particular local government officials, so they were excluded. We have that a lot.